My name is Thomas Duvall, known by most as Taiwo, and Taiwo is a Yoruba name, which means firstborn. I grew up in Washington, D.C. I started painting in Catholic school. When I was in the second grade, it was around Christmas time, I think. I didn't do very well in school. I failed math. I failed American history. I failed European history. I failed algebra. But in art class, the nun saw I was doing art, so the nun said to me, Thomas, uh, since you did such a good job, would you be willing to paint something on all the blackboards in the school? Oh, uh, yes, sister, I would do it. And when I was 16, I had to get out of D.C., so I joined the service. D.C. in those days was still segregated. You couldn't eat in the restaurants if you were colored. When I came to New York, it was a little better than Washington, D.C., but I still ran into a lot, a lot of little problems. You couldn't get hired for this, and you couldn't get hired for that. So I took a few factory jobs. I went to art school on 57th Street, down the street from Art Students League. There wasn't any way you sit in it. There were black artists, but there wasn't, there wasn't a collective. After I finished art school, I tried to get a job as a art, commercial artist. They weren't hiring any black commercial artists. This one woman, she saw my samples. Wow, you are good, she said. You can work for me. I'll pay you $70 a week. But she said, when my customers come in the shop, I'm going to have to hide you, hide you in the men's room. So I said, okay, I'll hide in the men's room. And I got a little tired of that. So I just finally decided, look, I got it. I've had it. I'm quitting. We still have a ways to go, but they're, 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 I've seen changes, yes. <laughs>